Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be testing the fixed mount solar panel versus my tracker solar panel. We have the exact same wattage. They're both about 330 watt panels. So we have these two connected in series and the two tracker connected in series. So together they're both putting out 660 watts. Okay, but they're going separate. So this one, tracker versus fixed mount. Let's see which one puts out the most power throughout the day. I know a lot of you guys say, why not just add a third solar panel that will add up to what the tracker does? I have the solar tracker going to this EcoFlow and then the fixed mount going to this EcoFlow. It's 747, 747 right now, and you can see they're both not putting out power. So that means with a fixed mount, right around, you probably get start getting power right around 8, 830. The tracker, I have them both at the exact same angle, same position. I'm going to turn the tracker on and show you guys what happens. So you see, they're both putting out zero. And that's this right here. That's the solar input. Zero watts, zero watts. Let's turn the tracker on. Okay, guys, it says it's going to track in four seconds. Two, one. There you go. So what the tracker is doing, it's going to find the sun. The sun's right over there under those clouds. It's going to track it. Okay, guys, so it's right around 8 o'clock now. And you see the fixed mount is still not getting power because of the location, the position of the uh, solar panels. But you see the tracker is almost pointing right at the sun. And it's already getting 104, 105 watts. So that's where the tracker exceeds the uh, power from the fixed. Because it starts about a whole hour, hour and a half earlier. So you get power as first light. We'll see exactly what time this one starts making power. As you can see, they're, co they're both connected the same. This one's just, if those clouds weren't there, we'd probably be getting full power already. 118, zero. Okay, guys, we finally got the power coming on, on the fixed. It's going in and out. Finally, about 8.30. This one's been putting out 100 the entire time. Came on 45 and went back down. The sun is finally starting to hit it a little bit. There you go. 45. Once the sun goes down, it, it's coming in and out. So that's the difference. Your fixed, it waits for the sun to be over the panels. Your tracker, it will go find the sun. Start earlier. There you go, you're getting 238, 250. So this one getting like over 300. And your fixed is still getting 60. That's the difference. So when I'm getting 300 watts over here for two, three hours before this one even starts putting out power, because the sun is still over there. Once the sun comes out them clouds, I'll be pulling around 600 watts from this thing. And this guy right here will probably be in the low 50s, 60. Back to zero. On the tracker constantly over 100 and the reason for, for the no power yet because it's facing south this one's facing completely east and all the way up that's where you're getting that first early start facing all the way east already I'm getting 332 from the tracker. This, 
the fixed is putting out 89. It's at 80%. The tracker is at 73%, getting 333. Let's see which one gets to 100 first. The tracker has almost what? 7% less. Let's see which one charges to 100%. Fixed or the tracker? Just like you guys asked me, I could add a third panel here, maybe four. It still won't add up to what the tracker is getting. It's not, the, it's not a matter of how many panels you have. It's the time you have. This one's only going to make full power for around three to four hours. The tracker can make power for eight to nine hours. Full power. I can add four panels on this. I can add six, whatever I want. But it does not make up for adding panels to the fixed. Okay, guys. So I got them down to about set this one to down to 71%. It's pulling 330, 320 watts. That's the tracker. This one's at 78%, pulling 95, 100 now. That's the fixed mount. So I'm giving the fixed mount almost a 7% lead. Let's see which one gets to 100% first. Okay, they have the exact same panels. Same power, 660 watts. Let's see if the tracker or this one. I'll come back later and check them. So they're at 78% pulling 100, 72% pulling 297, 305. Okay, guys, the, finally getting over 200 with the fixed mount. 225. It's at 82%. It said it got four hours left to 100%. The solar tracker has 83%. It's getting 332. And it says two hours left to charge. So we're going to keep going. I know this is a kind of different test. But I just want to show you guys the difference between a tracker and this fixed mount. There you go. Four hours to charge, two hours to charge. And remember, this one was lower. It brought it up 7%. And it's consistently been putting over 300 watts. This one finally made it to 200 Tracker just dropped to one hour left, 84%, putting out 430. The fixed mount, three hours left, 82%, putting out 260, 270. I wonder what time of the day you'll get the exact same power with the fixed and the tracking. Remember, they both put out the same power. So at one time, probably around 12 o'clock, to one o'clock they're gonna put out the exact same power and after that time then the tracker will go back to being the one making the most power remember the fixed mount you only have a fixed time frame i think it's around 11 to 2 where you put max power with the tracker being able to uh, track the sun you pretty much put out peak power all day so that's the benefit. Adding an extra panel might not be um, that much extra power. It sounds like it will be, but I promise you it's not. Okay, this one's putting out 500. It's at 98%. Oh, this one, shut up. 630 watts. This guy right there already putting out zero. It was at 630. And um, it's at 100%. Shut down the solar panels so 
right at 12 o'clock everything is full charge on the tracker this one still has 20 minutes to go to be full charge so you can see that the tracker does give you a little bit more power all right guys just quick video showing you the difference between tracker and fixed mount um if you guys like this video please go ahead and hit that subscribe button give me a thumbs up and uh, leave a comment guys thanks for watching quick video fix mount versus tracker it's getting a little cloudy we're gonna have a little storm coming through here so i was hoping i'd have some more sun but guys thanks for watching this video have a nice day bye